Okay, should be live now. Hi everyone. This is Mario Brothers, and I'm I, I'm joined by Emily tonight. I am so excited to start. Yeah, you, we we've played Mario Brothers in the past, and what we've learned is that I'm I'm immensely better at <laughs> Mario Brothers. I'm just really bad at a lot of games. So it's okay. Just I respect. I respect it. Don't. I wouldn't. Don't, 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 don't do, do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, which one do I get rid of? This one's farther, but this one has 69 lives, so I think that one has to stay. Okay, we have to keep that one, obviously. What? There's no way we can get rid of that one. Here's baby Yoshi. New babies for you to enjoy alongside classic character like baby Yoda. Do you love baby Yoda? No. Would you do anything for baby no. Yoda? Anything? Mm-hmm. Throw him off a building. I love Baby Yoda so much, you know? If I loved Baby Yoda so much, I would kill Martin Scorsese and make it look like an accident because I love we Baby Yoda and by extension the Walt Disney Company. <laughs> I think also, hi everyone. <laughs> I have to show you this comic after the stream now because it's just like this this comic of I think like Boba Fett or something from Star Wars saying like, I love Baby Yoda and by extension I love the Walt Disney Company. And then Baby Yoda says, um, if you love Baby Yoda, you'll kill Martin Scorsese. And then Boba Fett's like, I don't know, I respect his work as a director a lot. And then Baby Yoda is like, if you love Baby Yoda, you will do this. You will make it look like an accident. <laughs> oh my god. Hi, everyone. I yeah, hi, reach. Zen, Robin, and Atticus. I'm Luigi. You can leave wherever you want. Easiest, easier. What does that mean? Um, well, Toadette has the peach at, um,. Power up, which makes it slightly easier, and Nabbit can't take damage. <laughs> I saw that look in your eye. <laughs> oh my god! The only thing is, you can't get power ups either. I don't give a fuck. I can't get hit. Who cares? <laughs> Maybe I'll want to change it eventually, but right now I'm very content. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna lower the game volume a bit so you're more clear, because we are sitting a bit far from the microphone. If you could get closer, yeah. That would help. I'm trying. I want to knock my phone over. Mm -hmm. Let me fuck my phone, I guess. But now my drink is so far. Crap, I drink. <laughs> Open it over here. Yeah. Yeah, put it there. Everything is fine, though. Mm-hmm. Am I yours? You have, like, 50. Mm -hmm. Well, these are empty. I need to get rid of them. Oh, you are hoarding. Mm -hmm. I'm hoarding plastic. I love plastic. Mmm, <laughs> solution. Mm -hmm. That was a noise. Yeah, that's what the sound creaking in my chair. Uh, well, Bowser kicked Mario and friends out of Peach's castle, and now they're taking it over. No, that's a little fucked up and twisted. Huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bowser's a bit problematic, is the thing. Problematic king. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he is a king. He rules a kingdom. So, I'm not wrong. Mm-hmm. Look at all the stupid kids. Ooh, you know the Koopalings are not his kids. <gasps> also, hi, Finn. Welcome. Yeah, the Koopalings are not Bowser's kids. Then what the fuck? What? Yeah, Miyamoto was like, no, they're not actually. But like in the old Mario cartoons, they were. <laughs> what the fuck is Bowser Jr.? Bowser Jr. is actually Bowser's kid. Okay, I was about to be like, what the fuck? They just had like a junior, a Bowser, but he's not Bowser? <laughs> also, Atticus says, nobody cares, Miyamoto. I agree. Bowser has eight kids. Okay, but who? Who, who, who gave birth to them? It's What's the really. Conspiracy? <laughs> okay, something really funny from Super Mario Sunshine. Related to Bowser Jr. is that, why would you take that? I needed that. You don't, you can't take powers. Well, I wanted it. Okay, I'm trying to learn controls. How the fuck do you get up there? I would have to get the raccoon. Huh. No wait, it's a squirrel. Why did I say raccoon? I'm thinking of Mario Three. How do I run? Yeah, it's like a flying squirrel. I want it. Hold on, let's get up here. I don't like this character anymore. I should have just played as Mario. You can switch characters after this. Okay, I was just like, how? Here, take a one up. 
I give you permission to get it. You're so kind. Also, yeah, Nabbit, Nabbit is a bunny rabbit. He's a guy who steals things because he thinks it's funny. So, just a... Yeah, he's a Joker type character. Now, the good thing, since we're playing this together, is we don't have to worry about collectibles. If we were playing, like, the original New Super Mario Brothers, then we would. Can you play as Dementio? I wish. I don't think you know who Dementio is. No. He's from Super Paper Mario. He's a jester. Oh, well, and he does evil fun. things. I'm a little evil. You love evil people. Should I go in there? I don't think there's anything in that pipe. There's something Nothing down here, though. Well, you just messed up the fucking sign. How did I mess up the sign? It's, it's down! It's down here now. Yeah, I don't like that. Mm. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Got hit by a Goomba stupidly. We love being evil around here. I'm evil. I think one interesting thing about Nabbit is I'm pretty sure at the end of the level, whatever power-ups you collect, they get turned into, like, one-ups. Oh. Well, so I there's still- I still don't want to play it. So. Mm-hmm. I'm glad I got power. <laughs> like, <laughs> did do anything for me. How many fucking times do they give this power up? Well, they have to make sure- This is the first level, and this is a baby game. They have oh, to babies. make- Babies. This is a game for babies and children, which is why we're playing- Oh, you can't even do this segment. Awesome. <laughs> I hope you didn't want any coins because you got nothing out of that. Great gameplay. <laughs> you love it. You love to see it. Great. It's, oh my god. What they did with this game with the Toads is dumb because now they're both the same character but they, you like switch their skins and it's like, that's not what I want. I want both blue and yellow to Toad here with me. Got a thousand points. I'm a winner. Oh my god. Look at all those one-ups you're getting. So I don't want to be him anymore. <laughs> Maybe I should go ham for like one more level and then I'll switch. Mm-hmm. And I just, so I can have all the one-ups. Yeah. Because I think you specifically is going to need it. Like, we're going to so get tilted at the about. tunnel. Getting tilted at the tunnels. I love getting tilted at the tunnels of Fortnite. What's your favorite Fortnite dance? Uh, my favorite Fortnite dance is uh, flossing. Well, that's because you're a fool. And you're going to hell, buddy. I'm trying to squeeze in there. You get nothing. I left. I'm not here for you to get secrets. Oh. I want the secret. I'll just stand here. <laughs> right in front of you. Fuck off. Excuse uh, me, you're in my way. You're in my way. You're in my fucking way. Excuse me. Ow, ow. I want to try to get injured, but I can't. Yeah, you can't. This, this I can't. This game's not fun when I can't be injured. Ow. <laughs> Please don't kill me. Get your bingle bongle. Yeah, that's what they call the fire flower now. It's a bingle bongle. <laughs> you know me. I'm getting bingled at the bongle. I'm gonna wait. No, you can you can leave. I'm waiting. <laughs> I wanted it to deliver me. <laughs> we... This is my favorite part of Mario. When you just slide. Yeah, when I can do that slide. Okay, I'll take this. Mm -hmm. I want to take all the credit. I know you do. <laughs> I wish this had the system that Super Mario 3D World has where you compete with scores. Can I get in here, please? I that shit's those. always funny. Ow. Well, I just stole those two, so you get nothing. It's fun. Why would you do that? There's a <laughs> secret. Do now I can't know? get the secret. Yes, you can. There's a guy over here. Okay. 
That was I don't think secret? I don't think that was the secret. I think it was the other block. Can I not just? Yeah, so it can go on the fucking ground. I think I did it wrong. <laughs> you think? <laughs> well, at least we know there was a secret. Secret tunnel. Secret tunnel. I can't get up there. No! I'm going in. Okay. I'm going in for the kill. This has gone on long enough. I'm Followers going backwards. Kill. We'll go backwards faster. You know, this character kind of scares me. I don't like his vibe. You don't like Nabbit? No. His vibe's a little scary. Oh, you jumped <laughs> on me. This whole stream is just me fucking you over. Mm -hmm. Oh. But that's the fun of it. See, if it was just me playing New Super Mario Brothers by myself, it'd be too easy. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. There you Thank go. You. Oh. I love terror. Trouble. <laughs> I love getting in trouble. I don't. I once got in trouble. Yeah? Tell me all about it. No, that's all. <laughs> once I got trouble in Terrorist Town. Oh, why? Because I love terrorism. <laughs> <laughs> that's bad. <laughs> I think it's good. I think you're a little twisted. Yeah, I'm the Joker. And everyone leaves. <laughs> they want to hear you talking. I again. thought it was awesome in the Joker movie when he did the dance in front of all the people and they were like, Yeah, Joker, we love you, Joker. And he's like, Oh, yeah, it's good. It's good to be evil. What if I was Joker? You are. Stop. Okay. Not. You watch the second block, I'm watching the okay. first. This is how we coordinate the win. Second block is second. First block is first. Wow, they did a good job. <laughs> that was so hard. You know, one thing I don't like about this version of the game, of, of the Switch, uh, uh, rather the Wii U version, mm -hmm. it keeps giving you the super crowns even if nobody is playing as Toadette, and it's like, I don't need this. I was like, why would you do that? Oh god, the crown. Not the crown. I remember when everyone wanted to fuck Bowser because of Bowsette. <laughs> Do you remember? I would rather not talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> Can I change my character? Oh, sorry. What the fuck? I'm sorry, I, okay. wa I wanted to play the video game. <laughs> I wanted to talk about how I wanted to fuck Bowsette and I did not. No, I... <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me! I did have a friend who cosplayed as Bowsette. Oh no! I had a couple of friends actually who cosplayed as Bowsette. <laughs> They're multiplying, and soon you won't be able to stop them. I wanna be up here. Bowsette was very scary. One of them dressed up as Bowsette for Halloween and came into school dressed up as Bowsette. Oh no! <laughs> It was, oh god! I was dressed up as David Dobrik. I don't know what that is. He's a vlogger. And everyone <laughs> said that I'm like him just because he's from Slovakia and I'm the worst and I'm Slavic. Mm -hmm. And we also have like the same haircut, which is really upsetting. So you just decided to embrace this YouTuber joke? Yeah, I was like, well, if they're gonna say it, I guess that means Ow. it's true in some capacity. Ow! Yeah, I cannot imagine someone dressing as Bowsette in school, especially since- was that in high school or was that, like, high in school. college? Yeah. I cannot imagine someone doing that in high school. Like, it sounds like something someone would do in high school, but also I just don't want to believe that. 
coins. Oh There's my no God, better I'm gonna feeling die. than stealing. You'll be fine. I don't know where I went. I don't know where you went either. Oh, there you are. There has to be a way to get up here, right? I guess so. I don't know. Maybe we need the squirrel suit. Yeah, in college, I would be more... I would be less surprised to see a Bowsette. Like, I wouldn't be happy about it, but, like, if I saw a Bowser in college, I'd be like, that's fine. She's getting her education. It's like that one, um, guy who kept dressing up as, like, Saw- No, who was it from fucking- It was- Was it Kakashi? Yeah, it was, like, Kakashi, the fucking accounting major or something like that. Yeah, and didn't, like, didn't, like, the uh, OP of that, like, come out and say, like, Hi, everyone, I'm glad you've enjoyed accountant Kakashi, but he got a divorce. <laughs> So I will no longer be dressing up as him. <laughs> I've been going through a really rough time. I can't yeah, Kakashi, Kakashi. I hope Kakashi is doing well. Do you think like? Okay, this is a terrible question to ask, but do you think that guy was kin with Kakashi, and that's why he kept dressing up I... as Kakashi in accounting class? I don't like your train it's, of thought. But it's also, not a great question, it's, but it's probable. Mm-hmm. I mean, I remember seeing a post that was like, you know, considering how big and diverse New York is, you could pass Nagato Kamado at any time on the street. Oh my god, I don't even fucking think about that. <laughs> I don't- I don't think you understand the amount of anime conventions I've been to, and the fact that anyone in that room could have been like, I'm Ken with Naito. I would <laughs> fucking choke myself. It's very scary, like, how mainstream other kin is now. I don't- I- I, like, hate it. And like, it doesn't help that I have friends who are into kinning, and like I'm not gonna be mad at them, obviously. Mm -hmm. It's just scary, because yeah. I remember, I remember the like beginning of kinning. I remember it. Started... Yeah, it used to be a, like a weird thing. Yeah, it used to be like a thing, people on Tumblr did. Yeah, but now everyone's just like, this is just a character I like, and I kin them because I like them, and it's like that's not. Atticus what it said he's Komida. I am gonna. Can I threaten your friend? No, you cannot I'm gonna threaten beat the Atticus. Shit out of you. <laughs> no, Nagito, if I see you on the streets, your ass is done. Well, it's okay because Atticus lives in England anyway, so you okay, won't see good. him. Okay, good. I don't want to see you. Where? Can I change my? Oh my god, I keep forgetting. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I keep forgetting. Ow! I keep just wanting to play Mario Brothers. I keep wanting to be kin with Junko and Ashima. You love Junko. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. Atticus is not actually Komida. Like, okay. I'm gonna be real. Mm hmm I don't hate Don Rampa. I just think it's boring. No, I mean, that's a fair impression I can't to get, get from a Yoshi. the first game. Oh, no, you can't get Yashi. Look, I'm beating the fuck out of him. <laughs> That's so sad that you can't ride Yoshi's Nabbit. This is the worst case scenario. Can you let me get the star coin? Can you let me, like, do anything? <laughs> I can't have any fun. Oh shit, I got hit. Go, was, go, go, go! I was go. At chat. Go, Yoshi, go! Come on. <laughs> I'm great at this game. But, like, I'm just scared about a few people who say they can certain characters. Mm-hmm. No, yeah, there's definitely some characters where if someone kins them, it's definitely yeah. a red flag. It's just like, I kin Kokichi, and I'm like... I'm no, yeah, if okay. someone kins Kokichi, uh, Uma K Kokichi, like, they're they're inherently fucked. I only kin Junko and Ashima. I didn't even like Junko in the show. She was okay when it wasn't actually her. <laughs> it's because, like, the show... Is Everyone, like so like, underdeveloped. Literally, compared to the I game. can't even explain to you how much I was I was ready for like Junko to be like the main person in the show and she was gonna live forever and then she didn't. Mm -hmm. And like maybe I should just play the game. No, you should. But shouldn't. also like I'm really busy playing Animal Crossing right now. I don't think you ever have to play Dong and Rampa. <laughs> I could've just ran forever. No, I want that! It's mine. I'm gonna- There's no I'm better thief. feeling than I'm stealing! You. I'm a thief. Oh. You get nothing. I hope you're Yoshi, you're Well, I'm gonna die now. Yeah, play Ace Attorney. 
Phoenix or Ace Attorney is really good. I will eventually. I'm gonna beat the shit out of this Yoshi. That's mine. This is mine now. Look at me. <laughs> I think, I, like, my opinion on Dong and Rampa has always been the first game is the best one, and it, like, has actual atmosphere that makes it, like, decent, even though the characters are pretty much nothing. Uh, but then the second game, it's like all of the characters are like- the second one where, uh, Kamaida then? Yes. It feels like all of the characters in the second game are like way too cartoonish, which is the opposite problem, because the first game the characters are like kind of bland and boring. So but it's then... just like a radical switch. Mm hmm In the second game, they're way too cartoonish for me. And they all exaggerate like their worst traits. And it's, like, super dumb, too, because the atmosphere doesn't exist anymore. The second game is literally, like, okay, so to justify the fact that they're on this beautiful island that's, like, great and the best place to live, it's literally just, like, okay, so they get a disease that makes them want to kill each other. And it's, like, what? I guess. You know what the disease is called? Murder? <laughs> <laughs> but, like... Yeah, that's the problem I've always had with Danganronpa 2. I feel like it doesn't have the same atmosphere, and it has, like, this stupid, like, everyone feels like a cartoon character, and it's just nothing to me. And then the third game I wouldn't touch with a pole, because, like, I've never heard a good thing about it. Even Danganronpa fans don't like the third game. No, like, I have one, um, friend who's super, super into it, and even she's like, no. The mm -hmm. third is not it. <laughs> You're gay for me. Oh. Also, hi, Mav. Can I change my character? Yes, you can. I give you permission to that? change your character. Um, I think we have to go to the menu. Not that menu. So, yeah, change character. That. I'm staying Luigi. I don't have my Mario's. Oh, shit. What yeah. the fuck? Ugh, That's Mario, weird. you're so ugly. This game looks super fun. It is fun. It's especially fun when we do chaotic things and play it together. I think you missed the part where I called Mario ugly. How could you say that to my friend Mario? Come on. I just... He's a good man. No, he he's an honest man. Works a 9 to 5. Mm -hmm. His mushroom heights. Baby Yoshi is ugly? <laughs> listen, if you... I agree. <laughs> listen, if you love Baby Yoshi... You'll love Baby Yoda. <laughs> if you love Baby Yoshi... I just Yoshi, killed my Good job, genius. <laughs> Listen, if you love Baby Yoshi, you will do this for me. You will kill Microsoft CEO Bill Gates. Oh my god, I'm like Make it look like an accident. now to actually play the game. I said Bill Gates because I forgot who does the Xbox division. Who the fuck is- Who's the guy? Is it- Oh, it's Phil Spencer who does Xbox for Microsoft. Yeah, yeah if you- if you love Baby Yoshi, you'll kill Phil Spencer. Make it look like an accident. Love, baby Yoda. Like and subscribe. Mm hmm And tweet me. Yeah, Microsoft is gross. All video game companies are gross to an extent. Except Nintendo. I love Nintendo and they've never done anything wrong and they would never take down wrong <gasps> sites. I should I should have never changed character. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I lost my Yoshi, so I'm not having fun either. We're yeah, but now I'm tiny fun. and stupid and ugly, and no one's ever gonna love me. Can and you not food. grab that? <gasps> you should have grabbed the mushroom. It's fine. I don't know what to tell you. Ow. Don't. I'm gonna piss my pants. <laughs> You're doing great. No. Stupid head. Give me that. It would have been really funny if it fell down. I, I took a Goomba fried. head. <gasps> Ooh. You almost knocked me right into that. Why would you? I think this is a secret. You know what the only good anime is? What's the only good Full anime? Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I still need to watch that. Good show. I'm rewatching it right now on Netflix. I'm on part four or five. What do you want to ask, chat member? Yes. I'm here to answer every question ever. Because I'm the nostalgia critic. Does the Thank Switch you know, have much be... lag? You mean like input lag? No? Who's the second half of the comedy duo? That's Emily. Say hi, hi Emily. Hi, I'm Emily. 
Mm -hmm. At Sorry Boys on Twitter and Instagram. We do stand up comedy together. I am a cosplayer. Mm -hmm. I'm also a superhero. I love Robin from Teen Titans Go. <laughs> Don't. We're not bringing up the fucking Teen Titans Go video. Okay? I have not stopped thinking about that stupid fucking song from that movie, and it sucks ass. Bad but frame just... rate. Okay, um, it depends on the Switch games you play. If you play a lot of the first party offerings, there is minimal lag. Um, yeah, offline games don't have lag. Um, some of the online games do. Splatoon and Mario Kart are pretty good about not having, like, lag. Stuff like Mario Maker and, uh, Smash Brothers, though, those are not great. And it's unfortunate, because Smash is one of the bigger games. But that one, that one sucks online. Are we just skipping all those? I mean, we could do those levels if you want. No, I don't care. We can do whatever you want. I'm just here to play a game. Mm -hmm. I don't, like, the thing about, like, going after all the levels is that at some point we'd have to, like, fucking get all the would star you, points. Would you like to get that? No. I changed my mind. <laughs> Tell. I can't get up there? If you can, if you try. I don't want to. That seems like a lot. Yeah, games like this have no lag although this is also not online multiplayer emily is physically in the room with me yeah M mario u doesn't have multiplayer mario maker does oh. but once again that one's pretty bad it's not great i think if you play with friends it's usually better but when you play online with randos it's like pitiful <gasps> i'm too scared to do anything in this game. <laughs> <laughs> you're never getting Oops. this fucking power up Oh my god, I thought I was you, and I almost fell until- mm -hmm. What the fuck? Also, no problem. I love talking about Nintendo Switch. Please don't die. <gasps> you died. <laughs> we both died. Ooh. Terrible performance. You hate to hear it. Yeah, rip to you, but I'm different. Games you played on Xbox had horrible lag. Really? I see. I've never really. I well, I had an Xbox 360 for a bit because my brother, our brother, yeah. had one. Um, although I didn't ever play it. I played it a couple times. I remember Did playing you? Assassin's Creed on there. It was a game. I don't have strong feelings on Assassin's Creed. That sucks, especially since like Xbox Live is expensive. I think it's like $60 a year or something, or even more. PSN is also really expensive. I don't know how Sony servers are, though. Look, now we both have it. Yeah. Oh, you could get up there. Yeah, I don't know what's up here. What's up here? At the very least, one thing that Nintendo Switch has, how much is an NES sub? Um, it's like 20 a year, um, and like certain things get you like deals for it. For example, if you buy like the Tetris 99 physical copy, you get, um, uh, the eShop is completely free, um, but the NES stuff is 20 a year and you get a selection of NES games from that. I don't remember all the NES games. Um, I mean, obviously they have the classics, like the Mario Trilogy, they have the two Zelda games. Oh yeah, they do have SNES games also. Not as many as the NES games, but they do have some SNES games. I've put a lot of hours into the SNES games. I think I've beaten, like, Yoshi's Island and Super Mario World several times on the service. Ow. I died. I will stay right here. <laughs> yeah, don't don't move in case one of you also drop dead. Will this have a mushroom? Yeah. Yeah, you get that. But yeah, I would say if you can look up, look into the list of NES games they have. Um, they're just they're kind of like free to play if you have the service. 
Do I like Panel de Pawn? Absolutely. Panel de Pawn is a fantastic puzzle <gasps> game. Piss. I played with Sienna a little while back. Yeah, it's a little bit like that. Please don't hit me. Oh. I won't. It's a little bit like that. You get the games. Um, the games don't really go away. They haven't taken away any of the NES Excuse games me, or SNES games. So they're basically like as long as Nintendo Switch Online exists. Also, we Why should fight in Panel Day Pawn. Absolutely. Message me after this stream and I will play Panel Day Pawn with you. I'm also sorry that I'm hijacking this conversation no, from you. How are I, you doing? I'm great. You can talk about video games all you want. Mm-hmm. I would answer if I knew anything. We should play Panel Day Pawn together. You remember I mean, Pokemon wouldn't... Puzzle League? Yes. That's what Panel Day Pawn is. So okay. you've played it before. It's like, I don't understand what you're talking about, but that's fine. Yeah, Panel Day Pawn is the Japanese name for it. Um, I... It's just called Puzzle League here. <laughs> Let's make a joke. We'll be like, oh, I know Japanese. I want to um, well, if you get the online subscription, you get Super Metroid. It's not oh, technically to, to own. own but, like, yeah. you download the SNES Online app, and you get it. Oh, did it not let you in the cannon with me? I didn't know I was supposed to go in, and it went yeah. <laughs> Here's Lemmy, I believe. Oh, he's so ugly. Oop. I don't like your vibes. He attacked me. Oh, oh my god, he's gonna come for did me. Did he die? <laughs> okay, no, you didn't. The only problem with playing multiplayer games like this is that my Wii U and Switch and my microphone kind of obscure the view. It's not a fan fantastic setup, but I can only do so much. Yeah, this is a clown. He's dead now. So Fucking go to clown school. I'm gonna go to clown school one day. Yeah, honestly, like, I would say NES slash NES Online is worth it just for those libraries. Like, it's cool to have the online features, especially since I stream a lot of online games like Splatoon and Smash, but, yeah, it's like, the NES and SNES stuff is really good. I hope they do N64 stuff at some point also. They have to, right? We could have Mario 64, we could have Pokemon Snap. Yeah. I mean, they're coming out with Pokemon Snap 2 some, at some point. I'm excited. Let's go to the desert. Do you like deserts? No. They're usually my least favorite levels. Oh, so hell yeah. I love, like, I don't I, I don't like to consider myself a shill, but I absolutely love the Switch. Oh shit, Emily's being called. Oh, Alright. Oh, well, I'll be right here. Yeah, so. You so, hi everyone. Dan64 has too many games they can resell for money. True. A lot of those are definitely longer games than, like, NES SNES stuff. Yeah, especially, like, Ocarina, Majora, Mario 64. Although, if they put one of those games on the Switch, I would probably be more likely to finish them. I did finish Mario 64, but I've never gotten very far in Ocarina of Time and Majora. I'm very bad with getting through Zelda games. Earthbound on Switch would be really good. Yeah, the Joy-Cons are not great with the drift. Um, they do free repairs if you live in America, but yeah, that's still an issue. Um, the Switch Lite, as far as I know, Emily owns one. I, I haven't heard anything about the Switch Lite having drift problems, but if you're going for the standard Switch, yeah, that's something you want to look out for. I would say, if you can... Get a Pro Controller, and if you don't want to spend money on, like, a $60 controller, the wired Pro Controllers are fine. Um, but if you're wanting to play in handheld mode, I would say get a pair of Joy-Cons, maybe even a spare if you've got the money. Um, and, like, as soon as you detect any problems, just, like, ship them off to Nintendo and be like, hey, fix my shit. Oh, Game Boy Online would be pretty cool. They probably would hold Pokemon hostage. I don't think they would be so willing to put a free Pokemon game on their service. Like, that's... Especially since that goes through the Pokemon company themselves. Like, maybe you could convince Nintendo? I don't think you could convince the Pokemon company, though. Yeah, Pro Controller is best. The wireless Pro Controller is best because it includes the gyro controls, which are important for games like Splatoon. 
Um, but if if you can't like afford it at the moment, I would say a wired Pro controller with with the Joy Cons should suffice. It sufficed for me. I don't have a wireless Pro controller, but um, the wireless Pro controllers are good, from what I've heard. Yeah, they did resell Link's Awakening. They absolutely Link's Awakening would not be on there. I like the Link's Awakening Switch version. Um, that was the first Zelda game I ever beat. Uh, but that, <laughs> that is a very expensive game for being a Game Boy remake. Especially one that's so similar to the original game. Also, yeah, Samus Returns was like, that was 2017, I think. Playing OG Link's Awakening right now, hell yeah. I tried playing the original Link's Awakening a long time ago. I got it for free on my 3DS, I think, through, like, before Club Nintendo went down. Um, and I enjoyed it, but I just never got very far. Because, like, every time I play a Zelda game, it's like, I play it for an hour. I'm like, okay, this is pretty fun. I'm gonna play it again at some point. And then I never do. Heard they're making Mario remakes. I don't know if that was ever confirmed. I know it's been a long-standing rumor. I didn't hear that for 1, 2, and 3. It's like Mario All-Star stuff. Maybe they'd put that on SNES Online. I don't know, though. Also, yeah, they would have to tread, like... Okay, what console can we put that we don't have- aren't, like, reselling games already? That would be cool to see, like, a Mario All-Stars on Switch. I heard they were gonna do- like, there was the rumor that they were gonna do that with the 3D games. Nothing really ever came out of that, though, especially since they stopped doing Nintendo Directs. Yeah, they just gave us Panel de Pon and Puyo Puyo, like, completely untranslated, which is still bizarre. Like, I guess they didn't have, a. Uh... Oh, shit. I guess they didn't just have that on the standby, but... I also don't know what Emily's doing right now. I heard our mother call her. And nothing since. I've never played For, for Whom the Frog Bell Tolls. How good is that game? I mean, if it's a Zelda-like game, I'd probably never get very far in it, but... They made Fontanando for Switch. What's that? I'm gonna look that up real quick. While I have the time. Oh. I don't think I've heard of this game. This is cool, though. Oh, yeah, Rygar. I think they put that on NES Online. They didn't, they didn't, uh, remake it, but it is on the NES Online service.
This game looks cool. Yeah. Pretty high praise for this game from the reception on Wikipedia. Also, yeah, Zelda games are hard for me to just go back to. I feel that. Oh, shit, why did I do that? Hold on. I didn't mean to do that. I can't quit the level also. Fuck. Oops. It's fiddling with the controller. Don't do that. Yeah, they can't get Mega Man and Castlevania because of the collections that Capcom and Konami put out. Can you imagine, though? Like, they just undermined their fucking big releases. I apologize. It's okay, I accidentally started the level. I didn't do anything, I paused immediately, but welcome back. Okay, I had to feed my bird. Oh, uh, Kiwi's getting rowdy. She was pissed. Cause she wants her food. She has a fuck ton food. <laughs> <laughs> she wanted more. Oh, she was I not supposed to jump directly in the sand? No, not defeat the bird. Eat, feed the bird. <laughs> not... I had to beat the fuck out of the bird. <laughs> yeah, it was a tough, it was a long and tough battle. If you couldn't tell, what have you been talking about? I just, uh, just switch stuff. Oh, yeah, I don't know shit, it's okay. I play Animal Crossing. Mm -hmm. That's all my Switch knowledge. Why would you do that? Because I'm evil. I can tell. Here, I'll push you up, or you push me up. Yeah. There you go. Coins. I'm drowning! Well, stop it. You're gonna get a game over. I just realized you have one life. Oh. I was gonna throw the shell at these guys. You are dead now. Well, welcome to my single-player Let's Play of New Super Mario Brothers, which is like the most boring way you could experience a New Super Mario Brothers Let's Play. Mario <laughs> dies here. Ooh. Oh, you're alive. How did you come back to life? I don't, why do I have two more lives? I don't know, but welcome back. Wow. I don't know how that I happened. I get to be in the Let's Play now. <laughs> You've intruded on my Let's Play. Oh, I guess I did get no. a one-up. Oh, bye. <laughs> if anyone wanted someone who was good to play this game, it's not me. Mm -hmm. Can you fucking- <laughs> What the fuck was that for? I love being evil. I know, but can you stop being a little twisted? <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna fucking die again. I almost knocked you into the dirt. I was about to fucking cry. <laughs> Don't die again. <laughs> I should just test fate. I'm gonna reach up there my stupid tiny body. Mm. Excuse me, I would like to get up there, please. Oh no, we needed one more coin no! to get a one up. Oh, I need that one up. <laughs> you really do, you're suffering right now. Oh no. Why would they put us there? It's okay, I got a one up. <laughs> I just feel like this game doesn't want me to play it. <laughs> I feel like I was having a better time when I wasn't playing as Mario. Oh my god. I need to switch back to the other dude. You need to switch back to Navit? Oh my god. Oh my god! I got you. I saved you. See, I'm not always evil. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I, I did not mean to do- I didn't mean to do that either. Oh, I have this. What's fine? I kinda wanted the squirrel suit. <gasps> oh, bye. Oh, no. You're okay. Can you- Ooh. Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh oh. Oh my god! <laughs> oh no. You tried, and that's what's important. I'm about to become Markiplier. You love Markiplier. <laughs> I actually do. <laughs> I think he's great. I think he's gonna get attacked by the <laughs> LA gangs if we don't stop them. <laughs> 
Oh my god. Did you hear that crack? No. That was my whole shoulder. <laughs> I love. I broke my shoulder. <laughs> I love bringing up the Markiplier L.A. Gangs post. It's like an absolute classic. I think. Oh. Hashtag save Marky Mo. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it, it's like if there was a gang war happening in L.A. Why do you think the their why first would they go to yeah why would their first idea be we gotta kill Markiplier to prove we're the better gang when that ever occur in any gang like not just in LA gang like any gang around the world any the, fucking, the fucking mob Yakuza that would one. never happen you know no I mean? one would ever be like our first target is Markiplier no one's thinking that the Yakuza are just like <laughs> yeah they're going all the, the Yakuza is going all the way from Japan to beat the shit out of Markiplier what is this twisted that's Nabbit I'm gonna be Nabbit okay and I'm gonna fight Nabbit with Nabbit Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go into Toad's house dressed as Nabbit, and he's gonna fucking cry. <laughs> I think my favorite add-on to that Markiplier post also was someone saying, someone to, at the Game Grumps too. <laughs> like, as a, like, yeah, but my first thought if I'm a gang member is I really gotta kill Aaron oh, Hansen. Oh, no, not Darkiplier. <laughs> they have to No, 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 let me change, let me change, oh, okay. because I'm so over playing Mario. I want to be, I want to be a good character that I won't die 50 times. Look, I have to play the easiest character. I'm on baby mode. It's okay to be on baby mode. I'm so embarrassed. When, we get, to, I'm when we get to New Super Luigi you, you're gonna wanna be Nabbit. Because otherwise it's gonna be suffering. Damn it. New Super Luigi you is gonna be fucked up, but I'm very excited to play that with you. I think we should make a list of games we should play together. Absolutely. I mean, this and New Super Luigi you. I'd like to be able to finish this on stream. If you are willing. Yeah. And I mean, New Super Luigi is also in this cartridge, so. But I can figure out more. If we can Stream. do it at some point. Um, I am indecisive, and I want to restart my entire Animal Crossing island, even though I put months of work into it. Do you <laughs> think I should do it? I don't think you should. I think I should, because I'm a little twisted. Oh, here's Light Yoshi. You can't bring Light Yoshi with you. I can't grab him. I don't think you can. Can you? Oh, you can. I just threw him. Okay. Oh, uh, what's easy about Nabbit is that he can't get hurt by enemies. Yeah, so I'm on baby mode. He can't get power-ups, though, which makes some paths unfortunate. He can still get hurt by falling into holes. But, I mean, most people would get hurt by falling into holes. It happens. Happens to the best of us. Mm -hmm. The best of us. No, I want that. What the fuck? Do you remember that one gym in Pokemon Sword and Shield where they make you fall into the holes? Yeah. How do you make him? You have to... I guess you can shake the remote like that. Yeah, rabbits get hurt by dying. <laughs> do you ever take fall damage? <laughs> Mario has. Not in this game. What the fuck is wrong with Yoshi? What do you mean? He's a little twisted. Look at that! He likes eating things. He's a baby. He's gotta grow up. I'm gonna throw him. <laughs> you don't like him? No, he scares me. That's not very nice. Okay, I'll go this way. And be like... Lava girl. And water boy. You're gonna get so many one-ups. I swear you've picked up like a million power-ups this level. Pick up another one. <laughs> <laughs> I actually did mean to do that. I don't think that was necessary. <laughs> I don't think that was necessary either. I don't like him. <laughs> I know you like him, but I don't. I think he's funny. I'm a little twisted. <laughs> I need to stop you're a bad influence on my life. Mm hmm I am. I'm gonna go up here. I hope you don't mind. I could tell you about a terrible- I, I just remembered a, a great RP account on Twitter. I'm an RP account on Twitter. By right, the way, I this- I will play as Chris McClain. Mm-hmm. By the way, this specific RP account got in drama with the Animal Crossing community because they ma they made up like a thing where it's like, oh, there's a glitch where if you do this in Animal Crossing, your switch will be bricked.
And do you want to know what this person is role-playing as? What? Asgore Dreamer, but pregnant. So it's like Asgore, but like... I'm hungry for something a little mischievous today. I guess so. I'm Asgore, but also I'm a little chubby. I I need to like. It's like it doesn't make can sense. Can someone please send like one of the pregnant Asgore dreamer tweets? Because like they're like written in such a language that's like I wish I could write like this, but instead I write like a normal person. Also, you got me killed by doing that. Yeah, the pregnancy is honestly not even, like, relevant. It's just for some reason they decided that they were pregnant Asgore Dreamer. Here's a tweet. Is it Monster King Bot? No, not that one. I have a- Fluffy Dreamer. Here, here's, here's a tweet. Pretty, uh, Rhea, why don't you read it out loud? <laughs> I don't think I want to. I like funny mungas. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Yoda, bub, A, B, Yoda, I love him, want to hug him and love him, it's me, King Asgore Dreamer, whose belly is <laughs> What? It's Asgore Dreamer Oh, pregnant. okay, I found him, I found him, it's okay. That's a good tweet. It's just a cat. Oh, here's another pregnant Asgore Dreamer tweet. Chicken and dumplings. Mama needs. <laughs> Asgore got that mighty ass looking quite plumping. I need Yoshi so that you'll see. We will break the monsters free. <laughs> Are you sure this isn't like a real poet? This is, this is a real poetry. <laughs> like is I. That Edgar Allan Poe. <laughs> Father, it's me, Michael. I found it. It was no, right no, no, where you said it would be. No, 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 this is a good tweet. Are you kidding me that they retweeted? <laughs> Crazy frog? Log into Gmail from home. That's a good tweet. Also, hi. Hello from Pakistan. Shout out to Pakistan. Welcome. Hello. I can't imagine coming in while we're talking about pregnant Asgore Dreamer, but hello. There is like six Yo Mama jokes in a row. No, no, no. Let me read these. Yo mama so asgore, she plump and delicious. Yo mama <laughs> so hungry, I eated her. Yo mama so scary, I spent five nights with her. <laughs> <laughs> Yo mama so mean, I divorced her. Your mama is a cat, so cute. <laughs> and then, yo mama so funny, I laughed at her. <laughs> Oh my god. Holy shit, why did they do that? Yo mama, so funny, I laughed at them. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna quote that for the rest of my life. I'm gonna be thinking about that forever. I'm glad you're enjoying these tweets. I need you to know that people were sending death threats to this person over Animal Crossing. And they're role-playing as pregnant Asgore Dreamer. Okay, but I got an even better tweet to read. I cannot believe my mommy and daddy play Animal Crossing New Horizons all the time and searching for fish. Oh, yes, they do. Sell them for bells and give them to you. Why are we not being seen? Oh, we don't do face cam. I don't do face cam. Yeah. We're both a bit disheveled. Just a bit. It's been a day. Oh, I don't want to You're okay. You're I'm okay. always okay. Have you done a face review? I have. Why do you ask? That's so quirky. I think you should jump onto the next platform. Right here? Yeah, because I was going to do oh, that. No, you should crush me. You should just fucking kill me. It's okay. I don't think you want to be killed. Yo, wait. What the fuck? This looked like chicken tenders? These dogs look like chicken tenders. <laughs> Too real. Why the fuck does my dog look like this and it looks- it's just a normal dog. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't understand. Oh, that's a classic image. That specific dog was passed around a lot. Also, we're still playing a video game, I need you to know- Oh, please don't get crushed. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> please don't get crushed. Dog, that would be preferable. Scaring me. Ow. I want that 
No, I, I want that one. one. I would like to have a power up. I don't want you to have a power up. I want to have a power up and win. You can't get power ups. I know. Oh no. Okay, I you almost died. Don't Father, die. it's me, Michael. I found it. I, it was right where you said it would be. And then it's a cat, mm. but the purple. I'll say, yeah, I agree. This is a nice game. I'm a huge Spider Man! Yeah, what? haven't you heard of Huge Spider Man? I'm a little scared. You're scared of Huge Spider Man? I should stop looking at Huge Beats, actually. Yeah, I think you're getting a little too into pregnant Asgore. But I really like this tweet that says, I got pets and kisses earlier. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like a sprite sheet. How do I get up there? We have to spin it. How? The ZR. There you go. You learned how to spin. I taught you a thing. Tumblr, let me teach you a thing. Okay, go. You can do it. I believe in you. Stay. 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 You can do it. <laughs> Take your time. Do you want to just bubble? Yeah, how do I do that? Um, hold on. What is the bubble button? That's not the bubble button. Well, That's pause. <laughs> That's also pause. Okay, I'll just press over let me I don't think there is a designated bubble button. Should I just die? Like in Hold the Hold on. original, the, the Wii one. Don't worry, I just died. <laughs> I don't think it had to end like that. <laughs> this is not preferable. It's not preferable for these mans to be like this. Uh, why my nunny namers got this cat in the hat looking motherfucker on them? <laughs> and it's it's Remy from Rats doing. <laughs> I need to stop. You need you to stop. never have told me about this account. I'm going to be thinking about it all day now. There's also like a recent account that got made called Swole, Swole Coco, like the character from Animal Crossing. I like Coco. I'm actually looking for Coco for my island. Mm -hmm. My friend thinks Coco's scary looking. Well, your friend doesn't have taste. Like, yeah, you don't know how to jump. You're being blasted. Can everyone... Hold on, I'll help you. I just <laughs> It bubbled me automatically. Have I ever shown you Barack Obama blaster announcement? Have I ever shown you Barack Obama? Mm-hmm. Do you know what Obama's last name is? I don't know. They never told us what Obama's last name is. Isn't that a little fucked up and twisted? <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of crazy. After all these years, like, I've been seeing this guy for, like, 12 years. Who is he? Obama. I don't know Are who... Are you hiding from us? Yeah, can someone tell me who Barack Obama is? I don't know. As an American, I have no idea who this guy is, but I keep seeing him on TV a lot. I'm just gonna... Wait, I can defeat him by myself. Yeah. We can never lose to bosses, I just realized. I'm a fucking winner. <laughs> we quite, quite literally can't lose to the bosses when you're Nabbit. I'm making this game ten times easier than it needs to be. It's okay, because playing in multiplayer makes it ten times harder yeah, than it needs so to be. I'm, I'm doing us a favor. Mm -hmm. Like, if I was on my own, we'd probably be I'd probably be at, like, the beach world by now. Although I'd rather do the ice world. It's like, why do they make you choose between playing the ice world and the beach world? Like, can I choose neither? I think I would go ice. Yeah, I usually go ice. Because I hate water. Yeah, the water levels are the worst, because they're so slow. They're doing a weird what thing the to the castle. What the fuck is going on? My they controller need to knock it is off. rumbling. It's scaring me. I know. You get scared very easily. You know I'm sensitive. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight this hammer, brother. I don't, I don't. I want to see if we can avoid him and get to that one-up house. Hmm. Goomba. I don't know why auto mod caught that. Oh, we also can't die to these. Yeah, just let me handle everything. Invincibility, hell yeah. You win the levels, I'll beat people up. I can't <laughs> die. <laughs> yeah, and the important Mario Brothers combat levels. Like it's Sonic Unleashed. Yeah. I love Sonic Unleashed. Have you even ever played Sonic Unleashed? No. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, I don't even think you've no, played- No, I played one level. Mm-hmm. 
It was great. You love the werewolf. I can. Okay. 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 Okay, try and get more one-ups than Bowser's. We can do this. I believe in us. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay, so far we're doing pretty good. Oh, get that! Ooh! I got the Bowser. Oh, no. Bowser. You got another Bowser! No, I didn't! You did. I saw you. Oh, I fuck, I got a Bowser. I got two one-ups. Don't worry about what kinning means. It's better that you don't know. Wow. Got three one-ups, though. Three one-ups. I'm only, like, Sonic Werewolf. That says Kins. Like, You're oh, reading wrong. I can't fucking read. It's so far. Mm-hmm. I don't. Oh. <laughs> okay, beat up the Hammer Brother for me. Or okay. Because he scares me. And he okay. can't hurt you. I'm just stupid then. Thank you. Free item. Another star. Let's get down to business. I kept saying Disney they'll copyright this and ban us. Mm hmm Disney owns all media. Just a look into the future. Okay, Shroom House. We're gonna have to pay attention to one item each. Can you pay attention to the times, too? Yeah. I think I'll be able to get a toad pretty easily. Oh, am I supposed to grab it? Yes. Go get it. Damn oh, it! Sorry. No, and I got the Bowser too. Oh, shit. That sucked. Worst case scenario. Ooh. Worst day ever. I hate it here. Let's do the mushroom level. Swing your arm side to side. I don't know why. I just really like the mushroom levels. Oh, it's got rocks. <laughs> I'm called for. Ow, it hit me. You're hurting me. I'm not really, but it's hurting my phone. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's kind of just mildly inconveniencing you. Yo, did you hear it's not the 4th of July anymore? So fuck you doing fireworks. Yeah, people have been doing fireworks forever, and it sucks. And I'm over Just it. Just push me off! Oh no. You're okay. Anyways, never celebrate the 4th of July. That was my license for today. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh my god, you almost pushed me off. Oh. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Get over here. Grab the grab the raccoon. I mean squirrel. I keep saying raccoon. I keep thinking of Mario Brothers 3. <laughs> Where do you need it to be? Oh my god. Ooh. If you guys are thinking. Is Emily even thinking about where she's going? No. That's why I keep dying. Because I don't care about where I'm stepping. Oh. I'm dead. Please don't die. Get the green. Okay, you didn't get the green, but that's fine. <laughs> How does it feel? <laughs> I'm okay. We were about to get two one-ups! Well, how does it feel? <laughs> Feels like fucking nothing. How does it feel to be the meme for once? Ooh. Bye-bye. Just don't fall off. It's that easy. Well, you were in the way. 
You're in the way. We won. I won. It was all me. None of us died. Not yeah, we didn't have a single death. Isn't that Deathless crazy? run. We're doing so great. This has been a deathless run. Yeah, we haven't run. died ever. So proud of us for never dying in Mario. What? What? Like, this part made sense, and then I got here. Don't say anything like that. Just in case. <laughs> <laughs> Just in case. It's very bizarre. People don't make sense. Anyways. I'm gonna... I'm gonna be a squirrel. I like being a squirrel. Squirrels scare me. Yeah, aren't you, like, deathly afraid of squirrels? I'm not deathly afraid of squirrels, but if I was crossing a street and the squirrel was on the other side, <laughs> I would cross the street to get away from it. <laughs> Take the ice flower. I'm trying! <laughs> my fear, my minor fear of squirrels comes from the movie Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, when Veruca gets fucking carried away by squirrels. And they, well, first off, they attack her, and then they carry her away. Why would you stand right there? <laughs> it's fine. I'm on a cloud. Um, Goodbye. I'll be over here, I guess. Why did you get a star? I got two of them. Oh, we can't hear Nabbit's baby voice. We have no volume in our ears. So yeah, we're glad you're I, enjoying the baby noises. I wish I could hear Nabbit's baby voice. I don't even know what that sounds like. Give me the one up and you get your one up. As long as you don't die. Oh my god, I'm on the clown. Welcome to the clown. Did you want the clown? Because I don't die. I don't really care. If you could get in that pipe, though. Okay. Oh, I can still try. No, I can't. Huh? Wait. Go back. Oh, shit. Hold on. We gotta hurry up. The cloud's gonna run out. Oh, no, I don't think we're making it. Oh, wait. You could kill this Lakitu. How far back do we have to yeah, go? Yeah, I was like, what? I didn't think we went this far. It's fine. I like how when two people play Mario together, even though it should all be all, by all means a cooperative experience, it is always competitive instead. And they indulged in this. Nintendo was okay with this in Super Mario 3D World, because you would get the crown if you got the highest score. Yeah. And I would always get mad if I didn't get the crown. I would usually get the crown. Yeah, you always got the crown. Why am I not going in this pipe? I'm holding up. I guess it doesn't work that way. Okay. Well, that Weird. was a waste of fucking time. I mean, we have like a million seconds in this level anyways. We didn't. We have 286. <laughs> Chump. I'm trying. Can everyone tell me your controversial opinions? Just in general. I want to start some controversy in the chat. <laughs> okay, I think there should be a Tumblr convention. <laughs> I think that's the most upsetting stuff that you've ever said. And it already happened, it's called DashCon. No, I'm gonna it. make- no, but I'm gonna make DashCon. I'm gonna make it real. Um, it's my idea for a Tumblr convention where, uh, we're gonna have the Welcome to Night Vale guys, but they're not actually gonna show up. We're just gonna the say they are. Welcome to the Black Parade. Mm-hmm. Wait, someone said something. Is it a controversial opinion? Read it. No, Atticus just said that he's making Dash Calm too. I don't like that. Give me get a different over controversial here. opinion. Get over here. What are you doing? I want to get that. There's something up here. I want it. Let me see if I could. Okay, we could push each on. other up. Yeah. Did that do anything? It did. We're in the coin room. You have so many lives right now. I'm invincible. 
Yeah, what's wrong with Dash Con 2? I'm scared of the number two. Oh, is that why you keep refusing to watch Shrek 2 with me? By the way, this is not a real thing. Emily has never refused to watch Shrek 2 with me. <gasps> why would you do that? You know how many lives I have? I know, you have so little. I, I thought you were really gonna just like push me back into lava and I was like, okay, that's a little fucked up. Well, I wasn't gonna do it intentionally. I was trying to run over those. Sorry for doing a murder moment. It happens Epic though. Murder moment. Top ten murder moments. What's your what's your favorite kill? On seven. What's your favorite pizza pie? Pepperoni. I don't like pepperoni. Pepperoni's pretty good. I think it's great. I'm upset by most meat products. Yeah, pepperoni's classic. I have to be a bit in, a bit of a I have to be in a mood to have a pepperoni pizza specifically though, because it's a little spicy. And like it's not ridiculously spicy to the point where like, you know, oh I can't taste anything after eating this. But yeah, it's no. just like you have to be in a mood to eat spicy food, you know? Unless you're like Well I do I have chili sometimes. Mm-hmm. I don't really I'm not a big fan of spicy food, but chili's pretty good. No, no, I'm saying, like, spicy food in general. Pepperoni pizza doesn't really do that yeah. to me. Pepperoni pizza, like, after I eat pepperoni pizza, I can still taste things. But, like, a lot of spicy food is like that, and that's why I don't eat a lot of spicy no, food, because it's like... I'm not big on spice at all. I don't mind spice, it's what just... What the fuck was that? I have to acknowledge that after I eat the spicy food, I'm not going to be tasting anything else. Yeah, I think people who like spicy food are a little scary. Because you guys are just so willing to not have taste buds. What if I want to have a funny ice cream later? You can't, because you can't taste shit. But yeah, I didn't I didn't mean that as like a thing pepperoni pizza does. I just yeah. meant like in general for spicy food. Holy shit. Pepperoni pizza is fine, it's exempt. I'm just like living on the dangerous side over here. Nothing's dangerous to me. Look at these ice flowers. I have to get one now because I hit a potobo. Oop. <gasps> uh oh. I got caressed. I was looking at this TikTok earlier. And I also got crushed. I finished my story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was looking at this TikTok earlier, and this guy was like, these are characters I relate to, and I was like, that's fine. Mm -hmm. And then, in the tags, one of the tags was hashtag total drama, and in my mind, I went, if this motherfucker says Courtney, I'm gonna be so mad. Third character, Courtney. I was like, God fucking damn it. For anyone who doesn't care about total drama, Rest in peace, but I'm different. But yeah, I'm I love. I, I, I love. Trust, I can't trust a bitch who likes Courtney like that. Okay, but uh, total drama Rama is kind of awesome. You deserve to be dead. <laughs> I'm just saying. What if I just like? Yeah, Emily. Courtney? Do you think Courtney is problematic? I think that she should have been fucking executed. <laughs> Like, Alejandro was thrown into a volcano, that should have been Courtney. <laughs> what about Heather? I liked Heather. I liked season two and three Heather. Season one, she was just annoying. Season five, she sucked ass. No one did good in season five. Season five shouldn't be a season. I fucking despise that they made all stars. It is an abomination mm -hmm. and I will never forgive. Yeah, amazing. Total Drama is technically a Canadian cartoon, but it was big in America. Yes. Like, especially when we were growing there up. There was, like, the big three of, like, Canadian television, which was, like, Total Drama, 16, and Stoked. Oh, what about Johnny Test? Who? <laughs> <laughs> I just what about Johnny Test? 
My favorite show, Johnny, Johnny Test. Johnny Test isn't really canon for you. <laughs> Johnny Test is my favorite Canadian cartoon. No. Honestly, I would not be surprised if Johnny Test was more popular than like any of those shows. You know why I'd be concerned if people said they canned from Total Drama? Who? Scott. Scott was in season four and five, and he was, he was even worse than Courtney. Mm-hmm. That says a lot. He tried to date Courtney. So you know he's a little fucked up. Yeah, Robin's asking who is Scott, because I don't know Scott either. Scott is like, this like, he's like what Ezekiel might have wanted to be, and it didn't work. He's, he's just like, no, he's like this country boy dude, and he's ginger, and he's an asshole. Him and Ezekiel would have gone along great. And he's also like- just You stay asshole. on the other side, I'll stay on this side. Okay. But yeah, I hated Scott. I also hated Anne-Marie. Season four wasn't a good season either. Is there a Chris McLean Kinney in Total Drama? Chris McLean Kinney? Mm-hmm. That's what I'm being told. In what season? I don't know. I thought you would know, you're the expert. I'm going to fly away now. Like, Sierra really liked Chris McLean, but she also was like... Yeah, they made Lashana into a ball, OC. I can't explain to you how much I fucking love that picture. <laughs> it's so funny for no reason. I'm sorry, what is your profile picture? Lashana ball, OC. <laughs> I can't hear you. <laughs> Overall, Jean of Total Drama Island is just the beta object show. Honestly, yeah. Total Drama Island was fucking incredible. And then every other show... Well, I don't even know if like other shows tried to do Total Drama. There were object shows on the internet. Do you know what object shows are? Or am I introducing this to you? I don't... I probably know what it is, but I don't know it by that name. So basically an object show is like, okay... You see this water bottle? Yeah. Imagine it with arms and feet and eyes, and then it's a character, and they have like a whole cast of like inanimate objects as characters, and they're all named shit like Leafy and Dorito y. I don't know why those are the first examples I thought of. Yeah, and then people kin them. And they're like these animated so Lashana shows. Ball was I guess so, but it really is like, these shows are formatted in a similar way to Total Drama, where it's like a fake reality show, and like, people get voted off and stuff. Well, the point of Total Drama was, it was supposed to be a parody of every reality show ever. Mm-hmm. Like, Big Brother was big at the time. I think Big Brother's still a thing. I just don't care at all. Oh my god, don't die. <laughs> I'm trying not to. This level is really pretty, though. I hate it. I just thought it was boring. I didn't hate it. I don't know why I said I hated it. Like, fuck Big Brother, but... Oh. But yeah, like, object shows are, like, obscenely, like, popular with, like, Kinney's. Even though I there's... I didn't know that was a thing. Well, now, now you know. I'm introducing you to a, no a whole new world of knowledge that you don't want to know. Oh, <laughs> great. I'll put that in the old... <laughs> the old book. Also, hold on. Let's see the character that kinned Chris McLean. Yeah, I need to know... <laughs> is that from I think you're talking about that guy's from the Redonkulous Race Did I think he... he was the host in the Redonkulous Race <laughs> well there you go He's he can Chris Redonkulous Race I gotta tell you it's actually really good ow why would you do that active. You keep doing this. You keep putting the plants into the ground, and it does nothing for us. He's a contestant? Is he really? In what season? He's probably in the fucking, like, sixth season, which I haven't watched. Ow. He's in he's in Total Drama Rama, your favorite season. No, I don't know. I was actually like, is he fucking really? My can favorite you, is that in here? Total Drama Rama, they put in a uh, Jude from 16 because they needed Christian Potenza, who voices Chris McLean, to still be in it. <laughs> so they were like, Jude is voiced by him, so we're just gonna put him in. <laughs> and it's just so fucking weird. 
that they were just like, yeah, let's take these two shows that, like... They don't even have, like, the same art style, really. No, they don't really. I cannot imagine, like, a, a, a 16 character in the Total Drama art style. It would just be too weird. I loved 16, though. 16 was fucking incredible. You've seen the one clip that was, like... <laughs> what a group chat feels like, and it's like... Yeah, and it's just them talking about, like, fucking nothing. You gotta get a snake trap. That is, that is genuinely how the entirety of Sixteen feels. Like, it's just them mindlessly bantering about nothing. Mm -hmm. And then Jonesy says some dumb shit again. <laughs> Jonesy's kind of problematic. No, he is, though. We gotta call him out. Call him out to Jonesy. Oh! Get the greens! Thank you for getting the greens. Did you not see that, uh, like, reunion clip they did? And Jonesy was being like... He was like, I love Trump. <laughs> yeah, they made him a Trump like, so supporter! Funny, but at the same time, I was like, that is so Jonesy, and I hate it. Because he really... I don't know why Nikki dated him. I'm just- I'm just unsure why he's like a Trump supporter in the first place when it's a Canadian yeah, cartoon. <laughs> like, they're all Canadian. Also, yeah, here's Muncher. Emily's having fun on Munchers. Usually you would need a Yoshi for Munchers, but you're just- you can just do whatever you want as Nabbit. Yeah. God, this is so fun. I hope we do this at a normal hour next time. <laughs> And you are the monster. Well, we can do this for as long as you want, because I don't care. Well, I don't like to stream past, like, a certain hour. I mean, I will, but, like... Well, what is I, the hour? I don't know. We'll probably stop when we're, like, two and a half hours in, maybe around 10.30. It's okay. just, like, I understand that my audience is majority European. So, like, you know. I, I have insomniac I Europeans who need to go to bed. Mm-hmm. But the thing is, the pro I th the only problem I have with Sixteen and Stoked is that they have like the same character group, <laughs> mm -hmm. where it's like Finn is Nikki, Jonesy is just Re. Also, good night, Atticus. Thanks night for hanging Atticus. out. You yeah, go on. I'm trying to fucking remember. Brosif is just Jude. Fucking Emma, whatever her name is, is just. Caitlyn, but like Caitlyn's a rich girl and Emma is just like, I just want to be a surfer. <laughs> yeah, it, it was just like, they just made 16 again, but it was with surfers this time. But 16, Stokes is fucking great. Well, it's good that it's still good. It's, it's kind of like Scooby-Doo. Like, yeah, it's the same formula every time, but it's classic. I'm glad they didn't make another gen from fucking 16. I hated gen. That'll sound very bad out of context. Someone clip Emily just saying, I hate Jen. <laughs> send it to your friend Jen. Mm -hmm. Send it to all your friends named Jen. Yeah, send Let it them know that I fucking hate Send it to Jen. my wife. Your wife's name is Jen. Yes. You know this. Oh, yeah. Jen, if you're listening, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Jen is here to defend himself. Well, sorry, Jen. I'm sad that you had to find out this way, but I hate you. I this hated your work up. on 16. Yeah, J Jen was in the classic Canadian cartoon <laughs> yeah, 16. 16. No, we missed the fucking one! Yeah, that sucks. Well, well, maybe, also, maybe, both had banger openings. Maybe if you didn't say fucked up things about Jen, this wouldn't have happened. <laughs> All Canadian TV shows had great openings. Have you heard Johnny Test? <laughs> awesome, I love Johnny's test. Johnny! Oh my god, do you think he passed? <laughs> like, passed away? No. <laughs> what are you talking about? Did Johnny pass his test? <laughs> I thought you were talking about if he like died. <laughs> Johnny died. No, I was asking if Johnny was. Do you have Johnny fucking tested with me one last time? Don't throw my baby Yoshi. <laughs> I don't like him. I love him. I'm fucking crying right now. <laughs> no, get my baby. Fuck. I'm gonna I can't die. Get your baby. I'm you gonna let him die. Yeah, he is ugly. 
That's not very nice. That was my baby. <laughs> Johnny Test. You killed him for Johnny Test. No, let me go. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Jump me up. Okay. Jump me up. Thank you. Ow. It's okay. Look at this. <laughs> They're all trying to kill you, but they just can't. <laughs> oh yeah, two of the girls and stuff look exactly the same. That's probably true. Yeah, it's just hard to think off the top of your head. You know who's the best? There's two characters in Stoke that I think are the fucking best. And mm -hmm. it's Johnny Front Desk Guy, who's just this poor fucker who just wants to do his goddamn job, but then Reef and Brosif are alive and won't let him, and he's just constantly suffering. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then Andrew Bomber. Poor fuck. I yeah, hate Kelly. Fuck you, Kelly. Yeah, but but th you're right about that. Yeah, they look the same. They could only design two women for the show. Kind of a feminism fail. Okay. an F for feminism. Hillary Clinton is dead now. Oh. Ow! Hillary Clinton has passed away because we didn't do an epic feminism. <laughs> Johnny Test. Johnny Test killed feminism oh, and Hillary Clinton. not Johnny. <laughs> Oh my god, Johnny Test and Johnny Front Desk guy have the same name. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> fucking, every time I think of Johnny Test now, I think of the one weird fucking transformation sequence where he becomes like a sexy girl and what I hate it. What is his dog's name? Dookie. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the one Ruby of Johnson's song. No, his name was Dookie, no, I promise you. That's that Ray William Johnson song. No, it was the dog's name was Dookie, okay? Do you guys listen to my your fa my favorite Martian? Yeah, it's specifically <laughs> Emily's favorite Martian. It's only <laughs> It's only Emily's. Emily's the only I one who I'm likes Ray William Johnson. Right now. Oh my god, it's my favorite Martian, you can't have it. Yeah, it is Dookie. Everyone's backing it's, me no, up. No, it's not. That is I'm gonna Google it, and if you guys are fucking lying to me... It's n Nobody's lying to you. The dog's name is Dookie. I feel like you're lying. No. Nobody would lie about the dog from Johnny Test being named Dookie. Johnny Test. Dog. Dookie! Why is his name... <laughs> his name Why is, is this the second result? <laughs> <laughs> this is a picture of Buff Dookie. Why is the second result... It's just buff dookie. <laughs> he is... Can we play the game also? What the fuck does this mean? Durotagonist. I don't know. I'm an English major. I don't know what Can that anyone means. Can anyone Google what a Durotagonist is? In I think it's just a complicated name to say. A, 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 a complicated like way a to say a side character. Main. Yeah, no, like a I secondary like a second character. Main. Oh. Don't get squashed. You're gonna get squashed. I was googling what a drink is. A person second in importance to the protagonist in a drama. Because, mm -hmm. you know, Johnny Test is a drama. <laughs> yeah, the most dramatic show on television. In a world where Johnny is tested. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a little fucked up and crazy if Johnny got tested? Yo, what if we made an adult version of Johnny Test where he's like 26 and it's like Johnny gets tested for if he has alcohol in his system because he's drunk driving. Whoa. So well, if he's drunk driving, then we know he has <laughs> Well, the audience knows that, but the police don't yet. I don't want to talk to the police. They scare me and they're ugly. Mm -hmm. If you're a police officer, you're ugly. We know. And I'm no, I don't want to be mean. But it's just a known fact that if you're a police officer, you're probably ugly. Anyways. Ow. What's your favorite Your Favorite Martian song? My favorite Your Favorite Martian song is, uh... I like 8-Bit World because it reminds me that I'm a gamer and I love video games. I love video games! Like, it just reminds me that video games are awesome. Don't go through the door yet. Why did you do that? <laughs> there was something up there. Was there? Yeah, so I'm now sorry. I can't get it. You know what you did anyway. It's okay, I got this. I got this. I'm gonna win. Let me do it. Let me get him. I think we should be- I think, like, New Super Mario Brothers should have a thing like Mario 3D World where you compete with each other for the crown. 
It's more fun that way. Let me get him. This is gonna be mine. Morgan. <laughs> I died. I told you to let me get him. I just wanted to feel important for the fight. Now I'm drifting away. This is what happens when you try to be dookie test. I'm not being dookie test. Okay. What the fuck is his sister's names? Susan and Mary. <laughs> I could have told you that. Dumbest names ever. <laughs> oh, and now I have Johnny Tez's dog name in my fucking Google history. I don't want people to know I was looking up Johnny Tez. Why did they make fun of me? I, I, you know how many people look through my search history on my phone? <laughs> <laughs> While I'm at home doing nothing with my phone in my hands all day, every day. Mm-hmm. Prickly Goombas. Sorry. Ooh, let me get him. Let me get him. Let me get him. Oh, man. You took the power-ups from me. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Well, what is now this I'm do? dead. It does nothing. Move on. Okay, I'll just keep running. Running and running and running. <laughs> I'm just gonna run. I hope you don't want to play the game because I'm just gonna run. <laughs> oh my god, I got a secret. You did it. You did a very bad job of getting the secret. Also, it's a Yoshi, so you can't even use him. Did you not oh, use Yoshi? get back here! No, get back here. We're getting. I'm getting the other Yoshi. You love gaming, don't you? <laughs> Only sometimes. I'm gonna let you handle this. I think you've got it. I like how you have double the lives that I have, even though I'm playing way better. <laughs> now I think I'm doing even better than you are. Obviously, because I have more lives. <laughs> also, good night, Zen. Thanks for hanging out. Good night, sleep tight. Don't let Johnny test fight. I think we'll beat this world and then we'll be done for the night. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. And I think next time we can do the rest of the game. That'll be four worlds. I think we can do that in one night, especially if we start earlier. Yeah. You just gotta tell me what night you wanna do. Um. Well, I wanna stream Shadow the Hedgehog tomorrow. Because I haven't streamed that in a while. Yeah, um, but then... everyone exclusives. Shadow the Hedgehog tomorrow. Yeah, but then the day after that, I'd be good. Um, that would be Tuesday. So yeah, Tuesday we could do it. Everyone, mark your calendars. I'll be back Tuesday. Mm. I will Google some Johnny Test facts. Oh, please tell us all the Johnny te <laughs> that Test facts in your bed. I, I know think while we should play, we should also simultaneously make a tier list about something. <laughs> what tier list? I don't know. Is there a tier list anyone wants to see? What do we... The characters from shows, games, our favorite YouTubers. Like I don't want to do a YouTuber epic tier list. <laughs> yeah, epic rap battles of PewDiePie. The... I think epic rap battles of history is awesome. I think they wrap. I wish I could get up there. Do you wrap? Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna wait. You know how much I am a fan of epic rap battles of history. Yeah, I know you love rapping. Ow. Right as a firework went off, I got hit. I blame the firework. Yeah, fucking fireworks. Like, it's not 4th of July anymore. Shut the hell up. I just, I think the 4th of July is stupid. I think that the fireworks are loud and people need to stop. Mm -hmm. I always hated fireworks. 
I think they're fun if you're at Disney and you're watching the parade or the fireworks show. But other than that, totally fucking unnecessary. See, I don't even care about it then. I'm just like, I don't. This is just light. If I want to play with lights, I'll turn the light switch on and off. <laughs> yeah, what a thrilling life. That's how I feel about fireworks. Maybe that makes me boring, but I don't care. Oh, I'll get the last one. Yeah. Epic moment. I don't know how that happened. What did you do? Wait. Goodbye. I'm Will finishing. You just let me fly away like that? Mm-hmm. Because I'm evil. I can tell. You know who you oh, remind what happened? me of? Hold on, we're getting a special gift that you can't use because you're nabbit. You also killed me. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, we don't get it until we select it in the menu. I could go to sleep right now. Yeah, let's finish this world and then you can go to bed. I'm not going to bed. I have full middle alchemist to finish. You're gonna finish the whole show? It'll probably be a tomorrow thing, but I do want to watch as much as I can. Mm -hmm. I'm like, there's five parts of it for Brotherhood, and I am on part four. Like, I just started part four, I think. Don't go in that door, it does nothing. I've also watched the show before, but like, that doesn't matter to me. It's not different. This is the door. Okay, I trust you. Trust me, I've played this game before. Yeah, this is the right door. I don't remember which of these two is the right door. We could just kind of pick whatever. Let's go in this bottom door first. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna let you pick doors. Okay, now this is not the correct direction. However, we can do this. What do these blue coins do? They're just regular coins, but they're colored blue. What are the, the blues do again? Oh, uh, they're fun. scary. Mostly. Ah. Uh, I'm afraid of ghosts. I ain't afraid of no ghost. I am. I'm very afraid of ghosts. <laughs> oh. Goodbye. I, I almost mean walked in that door. Do that. It happens. What if I put us in the same exact door again? I don't remember where to go from here either. I want to say that door that's covered by the blocks. It's like I shouldn't even play the game anymore. <laughs> I didn't mean to go in there. Well, you did. Okay, that was not progression. No. Because now we're back in this room. Well, I died again. Now I feel like I have to watch every season of Total Drama over again. And just like, think about the consequences. You have, your actions have consequences. When will you learn? No. I feel like I'm playing my own game. Yeah, you're playing Leapfrog while I'm playing Mario. <laughs> I'm playing- how many fucking times can I die, frog? I'm making pipe bombs. That's quirky. That's what Donkey said in Shrek. What, what do you think Donkey's doing? 
<laughs> what do you mean, his real name? <laughs> I feel like he's hiding something from us. His name is Donkey, and no. he's a donkey. It's that simple. I feel like you're lying. I feel like he's lying. I'm not lying, and I don't think Donkey is either, and I think it's offensive for you to imply that Donkey is a fucking liar. Okay, Donkey would never lead me astray. <laughs> donkey has never led me astray, and I know this because donkey I've watched every from Shrek movie. Shrek, a real name. His name is Donkey. No, it's Eddie Murphy. <laughs> no, Eddie Murphy no. is just the guy who played Donkey. No. I googled Donkey from Shrek, real name, and it says Eddie Murphy. No, his real name is Donkey. He's a donkey named Donkey, and he's played by Eddie Murphy. The donkey in Shrek was just called Donkey, and it seemed to have no specific name. However, while watching the first Shrek movie in a movie house, I heard someone call Donkey with a name. He said, that's Eddie Murphy. It's Eddie Murphy. <laughs> it's, it's, that's his fucking actor's name. I think you're just mad. Someone's playing Fortnite. Awesome. I love Fortnite. Man, I wish we were playing Fortnite. We could. Yeah, let's do Fortnite. I've never played Fortnite in my life. No, we're not talking about Donkey. We're talking about Donkey. <laughs> Two completely different entities. For example, Donkey has not been found in violation of the Geneva Convention yet. Now, Donkey has. Donkey has committed what? several war crimes. Oh! <laughs> Wait, you don't know about the Geneva Convention? No, Donkey's real name is also Eddie Murphy. You, you can tell them. It's not his real name. Yes, it is. I just Googled it. It's, Donkey's real name is Jason. It's Eddie Murphy. You just killed me! Well, that's because you're telling me lies. I would never spread false information about, like, Donkey's name being Eddie Murphy. Why would I ha What would I get? Out of that. What would I gain from lying about that? Being a mischievous little imp. I think you're being stupid. And you're just not willing to take a risk in life. What are you talking about? <laughs> Taking a risk in life. <laughs> yeah. Do you think Jack Black's okay? Mm-hmm. Like, no, for no particular reason. Why, do you think Jack Black's in danger? <laughs> no. <laughs> can you get that? Yeah, can you, you can't, like... You can't get hurt by the thwomps, so... Yeah, but I can't reach. Wall jump! There you go. I don't know why you thought you needed me. me. <laughs> you almost pushed me into it. I know. It. <laughs> you oh my god, twisted. you keep trying to kill me! Oh, like you have. Oh, what? The, why would you do that? <laughs> I literally didn't do anything. You did that to yourself. <laughs> All right, what are like the top five cartoon characters you want to kill? Specifically, cartoon characters for toddlers. For toddlers? Mm hmm. Like, I'm talking like shows that you would show to a preschooler. Pinkie Pie? <laughs> it's, I mean, it's My Little Pony for preschoolers, I guess. Kinda. Yeah. Um, it's not really educational. Though. I was thinking more like educational shows. Educational shows? Like what? Like Barney, Elmo, that kind oh. of shit. Oh. Like well, what? Well, I know I wouldn't kill Big Bird. Mm hmm Because if I tried, he would kill me. <laughs> no, yeah, Big Bird is big enough where he'd probably win that battle. Awesome. I thought you were just talking about cartoons, because like. Okay, I no, know, it's just I like in general. Cartoons. Can I give a real answer? Or yes. do you want only fake ones? I want to know what cartoon characters you would kill. Lila Rossi from Miraculous Ladybug. I don't know who that is. I got it. She just sucks ass. Um, if you want a fake answer, we can go, um, the rat from fucking, what's the show? Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Fuck. From oh, I need to not die here. I die here. <laughs> oh my god, what's that show? Wayside. Mm -hmm. Sammy, the rat. You know what's funny about Sammy? Mm -hmm. He's already dead. I think that's kind of fucked up that he died. The fucking chef in the show 
whatever her name is, keeps him in a drawer in her kitchen. Well, that's where I keep you. And I only let you out of our kitchen drawers to do streams with me. You have no Look, life it's outside. Sammy. Of that's a plague rat. That rat has a disease. Can we play the game? Yeah, but the, the chef keeps him in like a drawer and then like makes it interact with people. So is it like a ratatouille situation? I guess not if he's not controlling him, but like you know what but I mean, like a rat dead. congregating. <laughs> oh. The rat's dead. That's the point. And but... this is like a show for babies. I, I don't know. It was on Nick, I think. What SpongeBob character uh, would you kill? What SpongeBob character would I kill? Yeah. I would kill SpongeBob and Patrick because they take control of Squidward's house and obliterate the city, and like Squidward gets in trouble, even though yeah, but like they they're the in town his house. And Mr. Krabs. Ah. This is where the Squidward torture forms get really bad in the show. I don't remember the clip at the all. What? Have no! you never heard, have you never heard that term? <laughs> Please don't die also. I am currently suffering. You took that from me. I, I could have taken that. I know I did it to be evil. Oh, I didn't do that. We both Great. <laughs> We're never gonna beat God this castle. God fucking damn it. Robin said that they'd kill Larry. Yeah, fuck Larry. Although that would be a very hard hard fight to win, because Larry's so big and buff. You're right. Larry's scary. I want to kill the my leg guy, <laughs> just so I can hear him say my leg one last time before I shoot him. <laughs> That's a bit violent. That's a bit fucked up. I guess Larry would be lobster sized if you saw him. So could I just like crunch him? I, I guess. That would be weird to do to a lobster, though. I wouldn't no, want to I'd crunch a lobster. No, I'd kill Pearl. <laughs> she already got killed by Bubble Buddy when he ruined her autograph. Which Who, was the... the boy band in the show? I don't remember. I know what you're talking about, but I don't remember what they're called. Boys Who Cry, that's what I they're called. I was thinking that, but I was like, there's no way that's what they named it. No, they did. Okay, great. No, it's very funny that they named them Boys Who Cry. Because I always get messed up because there's like three shows that have put a boy band in it, and it's like Gravity Falls, Star vs. the Forces of Evil, and Spongebob. Like, I know Star vs. the Forces of Evil, they named them Love Sentence. Gravity Falls, I've got nothing. <laughs> I don't fucking remember what they did. Oh, several times! Mm -hmm. As opposed to a singular time. <laughs> Only one time. It's like the opposite of One Direction. Do you want me to go up? Yes. Man, that's probably what they were parodying. They were, because that was right around when One Direction yeah. was big. I'm pretty sure that's what that episode was. I don't know how I didn't realize that until just no, now. No, I think you didn't realize that. I probably did realize that, but I forgot until exactly this moment. Because I'm not, you like... Me? I'll just go in the door. And no disrespect to the One Directions, but I... I like, love they're not some Directions. They're not something I actively think about. I do. I know you do. You love One Direction. I actually... I'm, this is an exposed post for me, I guess. Mm -hmm. I was a One Direction stan mm -hmm. for, like, five years. Tell us your funniest One Direction fandom po thing. Because like, I can think of it right off the top of my head. And yeah, it's that what? you used to read One Direction fanfiction on Flipnut. Which yeah, is extremely that is funny. That's so fucking funny for no reason. That's like really funny to think about. Oh my god, can I tell you a story? Yes. It's so fucking embarrassing for you to even talk about this, but also like, fuck. Also, we can't lose this boss fight because there's no holes to fall in. So, I had a friend, mm -hmm. a One Direction stand twitter, <laughs> yes. who switched from being a One Direction stand twitter account to a Michael Jackson stan <laughs> account, and she was like, will you still be friends with me even though I stand Michael Jackson now? And I was like, no, <laughs> he's dead. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just wondering- <laughs> 
Yeah. I'm just wondering how you go from one direction to Michael Jackson. It was, That's not like the logical jump I would think of. It was so fucking funny that she was just like, will you still be my friend? And I was like, no. <laughs> I was like, how can you stand him? He's dead. <laughs> I just love your reasoning is that he's dead and there's no other reason. I also, like, don't like Michael Jackson at all. Because, mm -hmm. you know, Michael yeah. Jackson's a weird guy. But, I was just... Was I like, just I just like the idea that that didn't matter at that moment to you. It was just like, dead. but he's dead. So, are you okay? You're so fucking funny. <laughs> We could do this level real quick also, since it's yeah. before the jungle. Technically. Technically, it's before the jungle. I'm Actually, it might be part of, like, of the jungle. I'm trying to think of, like, the best One Direction fandom moments that I remember that aren't actually the best. Well, the one best One Direction fandom moment will always be One Direction Imagines, because they are inherently funny. Oh my god. Someone made it. You know the fucking Niles in your ear? Yes. Someone... So TikTok added this fucking um, filter for some reason that lets you move your head, like, your whole body into, like, something, mm -hmm. and someone put themselves in Niall's ear, and they were like, how the tables have turned! I'm uh. fucking crying! If I can find it, I will show it to you. I, I was like, man, you could do anything on the internet. <laughs> mm -hmm. I could be in Niall's ear. <laughs> and guess what? He can't do anything. I can't get out of <laughs> it. Help me collect these coins. I died. Coins. Get the coin. Wait. Seven. Oh, fuck. No! So close. We missed the coins. This is worst case scenario. This is what happens when Niles in your ear and you won't get out. Yeah, you try and get him out, but he is there. Ow. My favorite... Okay, this one's really stupid. No, this is, I should say this is my favorite. There's one that's like, you and Harry are at a wedding together, and he's like, you want a date? And you're like, I don't, and he's your second cousin. And he's oh, like, do you no. want a date? And you're like, I don't date second cousins. And he goes, now you do. <laughs> I think if Harry Styles ever said, like, specifically if Harry Styles said that to me, I would be like, I would like call, like, I would have- I would like have to call someone. I don't think it would be the authorities, I- but I would have to call someone. Just... I would be very scared if- n That is like... so fucking funny though for no- it's just like, why is he so mad about it? <laughs> He's like, now you do! Like, what the fuck? No, if Harry Styles said that to me, I'd think he's like turning into a serial killer. I'll always love the ones where it's just like- you get teeth surgery. <laughs> I think one of my favorite. you the teeth? <laughs> I think one of my favorite One Direction imagines is the one where it's like Harry Styles is like going into the water and he's like, "I'm going to find her." I'm and then, her! <laughs> <laughs> but Harry, she drowned two years ago. I know, I killed her. <laughs> I don't remember that version. No, there's one where they're like Harry, you can't find her. She drowned, and he's like, "I know, I was the one who." <laughs> <laughs> well, I was thinking of a different one. He was like on a jet ski. No, I know exactly what you're talking about. How did I kill him? We have to get the torpedo to hit into oh, him. Oh, okay. Maybe I should. Follow me here, missile. Come here, come here, come here. Fuck. Come here. Yeah, guide it over here. Fuck yeah. Uh -oh. This is also another boss fight we technically can't lose. Unless we run out of time. That's the only way we can lose these boss fights. I'm trying to think of another Imagine. There were so many funny ones. Well, Robin mentioned one about the Grape Bowl. Oh my fucking god, I think I know exactly what you're talking about. What's Which one's the Grape Bowl? I'm trying to remember exactly what it is, because I don't like remember it exactly, I but I, I know that phrase. God damn it, Bowser Jr. is being- what the Stubborn. Don't go right Ow. in front of it. <laughs> Don't go right in front of it. I like the ones where it's just like, imagine, 
you're at a concert and Louis looks at you. <laughs> and it's just like him with like the weirdest face ever. And it's like, wow, God, I, I wish that was me. <laughs> I remember there was one where it was like, imagine Harry Styles stabbing you. <laughs> and it was like nothing else. It was just, imagine Harry Styles stabbing you. Also, is this the grape bowl? Let's see. Louis, imagine Louis throwing a grape at you. <laughs> You decide to throw one back at him, but you miss, so he starts laughing at you. You get so upset that you knock. <laughs> <laughs> you knock the entire point out of knocking him unconscious. <laughs> and it's by Instagram user Eat for Nile. <laughs> Thank you, Instagram user Eat for Nile. I will eat for him today and only today. We will eat in tribute. Today we dine at Louis. <laughs> We dine at Nile. <laughs> Can you come over here, our stupid head? Hey, Paisano. Little oh, dum dum. There we go. Sure. That took forever. <laughs> That's so fucking funny. <laughs> For no reason. Mm -hmm. One direction to imagine. I'll go look it up. I think we're good on the game also for now. Yeah. We'll, we'll finish the game next time. This should only be like one more stream and then we could do... New Super Luigi, you. Imagine your name, truth or dare, Harry, dare. Your name, I dare you to say that you love me. Harry, I chose dare, not truth. <gasps> oh my god, imagine! Can you imagine? <laughs> oh my god, can you imagine But that? can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> can you imagine that? Oh, here's Niall crawling into ear. <laughs> that is just like the worst photo of him ever. <laughs> no, I think it's really good. Wait, no! Wait. I, I need to. Can I? Can I finish this off with one? Mm -hmm. Imagine you wake up with your hands handcuffed together. Your name, babe. What are you do doing, Niall? Why did you drink all the milk, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Also, this is not accurate anymore. We did- we just did Mario Brothers. I yeah, forgot to change- it. I'm sorry, I forgot to change it after I did Tetris this afternoon. It's okay. But we'll- we'll do- um, hold on, I have my microphone partially on my it's keyboard. okay, I will just keep reading One Direction Imagines. We're gonna do Shadow the Hedgehog next time. Emily's not gonna be here, but thank you no. for joining me. Imagine, Harry, give me a kiss. You, Harry, not now, I'm busy. Harry, fine. <laughs> Fine. Just, okay. <laughs> it's like so anticlimactic. Imagine, guys, she's coming. She's coming. Act natural. But can you imagine? <laughs> can you imagine? Can you imagine? Act natural. Okay, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Imagine your name, babe. Close your eyes. I'm gonna get changed really quick. Harry, okay. Mm hmm. That's it. <laughs> that was the whole thing! I know! <laughs> Can you imagine? Can anyone imagine Harry respecting you as you get changed really quick? <laughs> <laughs> Someone mentions your name to Harry, and it's just him laughing. <laughs> Why is he laughing at me? He likes to make fun of you because he's evil. Oh, good. There's another version of the truth or dare one, but you also say, "You love me, and I'm the best." And Zane cho says, "But I chose dare, not truth." <laughs> yeah, Zane, say that you love me and I'm the best, and that you love me forever, and that people suck. Mm -hmm. Hey, imagine One Direction kidnapping me. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? What could you imagine? Um, imagine, interviewer, do any of you have crushes? Harry, well, we all know who Louie likes. Louie, do not... Liam, of course you do. You like your name because you never shut up about her. Louis, whatever, Niall. Just look at his face. Poor lad is love struck. But could you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I want some violent ones. I want one where Harry Styles Oh, goes okay, in. I got you. Imagine you and Liam go clubbing together. You're a little tipsy, but Liam didn't drink much because he had to drive you home. Outside your house, you thank him and he leans in for a kiss. While doing so, you feel a sharp pain in your eyes. <laughs> You you look down and see hands. <laughs> Damn you! He runs off and you bleed to death. <laughs> Why would he do that? What could you imagine? <laughs> Can you imagine him stabbing you? Can we do a stream where we just read it? One Direction Imagines? I think, like, if you just, like, downloaded a collection of One Direction Imagines and you, like, put them on the computer, I would absolutely just do that because that That's sounds so hilarious. fucking funny. Imagine you walking in the door and your little boy running up saying, <laughs> I'm the Bradford bad boy, as you laugh and ask, now who taught you that? Daddy, your little boy points to your husband Zane as he's cracking up. Thanks, Zane. But could you imagine? <laughs> But after you read the imagine, the entire- you have to keep saying, but can you imagine? I think that would get very tiring after, like, hours of that. Imagine, interviewer. So, Harry, what do you think about Niall's girlfriend, your name? Harry, well, when I first met her, she said that my hat was ugly. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Could you imagine? <laughs> I would- I, I called Harry Styles hat ugly. Why would you say that about him? You know how sensitive he is about his stupid hat. Yeah, he it's worthy of throwing a brick at him because of his ugly hat. I want to find another one where he kills you. <laughs> we have to we have to find one that's like good enough to end the stream on. Oh, here's the teeth one. Okay. Come on. Come on guys, where's the murder? Yeah, where's the violent One Direction imagines? I don't want any of this like lovey dovey bullshit. You're on your deathbed, and you use your final wish to meet Harry Styles. He walks in and whispers in your ear, You're trash, and I'm glad you're dying. And then he <laughs> spits on you and pulls the plug. <laughs> <laughs> what could you imagine? <laughs> Harry, why would you do that to me? Harry Styles, that's kind of fucked up. This is a that's fucked like, up and especially since that was like someone's final wish. Just like, what the fuck is happening? In these Unless classes? your final wish was being berated by Harry Styles. I, I asked him to pull the plug, actually. Oh, good. <laughs> Niles of Empire. That's great. Good for you, Niall. This also, one's so I love long. vampires. Oh my god, you know what my favorite Imagine is? What? The one where it's like you're at a fucking, like, a panic at the disco concert, and then. MCR comes out, and then oh Fall Out God. Boy comes I know out, and then Dan about. and Phil come out with their pride flags. <laughs> that one is so awesome. incredible. You're kissing Harry Styles. Things get intense so quickly that you choke on a spit and then you die. What? But why? Why would you do that? Harry, why would you me like that. Mm -hmm. All of these are like serious. I don't want serious one direction imagines. Dying. I'm gonna die. Imagine you're hanging out with the boys when you start to have a pillow fight. You throw a pillow at Zane <laughs> laughing because it was funny. He stops and looks at you disgusted. You fucking bitch. <laughs> he yells before beating you with a pillow. You die. <laughs> <laughs> From a pillow? <laughs> yeah, he kills you with the pillow. We can end on this one. Okay. <laughs> Imagine, you're front row at a Harry Styles concert. You throw your dog on stage in an attempt to get him to notice you, but your dog pees on Harry's <laughs> brand new Gucci suit. He immediately stops singing and starts freaking out, throwing a tantrum and screaming. He kicks your dog off the stage and it hits you in the face, causing you to fall and hit your head. Harry laughs as you bleed out on the venue floor. <laughs> oh my god. Harry, but could you imagine? I don't think I want to imagine Harry, that one. Harry, why would you say that? That's fucked up. Maybe we shouldn't end up that one. That one's fucked up. Yeah, that one's scary. I'm like... On, I want it to be fucked up, but not that fucked up. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to bring dogs into this. Mm -hmm. Come on, guys. 
imagine seeing the One Direction tour bus and you run toward it, but they run you over and you die. <laughs> <laughs> and when they move. And when they. And when they what? <laughs> <laughs> you want me to read it? And when they bury you, they <laughs> dance on your grave! You all have a good night. <laughs> Thank you for sharing with the class. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Oh my god. I, I literally, I'm gonna look at these all night. So if you hear me just like crying in my room, it's because mm -hmm. of this. I understand. Oh my god. It's an addiction. Oh no. What? Ew! <laughs> <laughs> Imagine. You and Niall are on your first date. You decide to get ice cream. You get a huge cone, but by accident you drop it. Niall looks at you and says, Don't worry, babe, I got this. <laughs> he leans down, picks up the ice cream, and licks all the dirt. I don't like this. I don't like this one either. He licks all the dirt off and gives it back to you. But could you imagine? <laughs> I don't want to imagine this anymore. <coughs> Nile, that's so gross. I think we're good to end Holy this fuck. now. Please do crying. Alright. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a good night and take care. Tomorrow we'll be doing Shadow the Hedgehog. Uh, I will be doing it. Emily will yeah. be slurping a smoothie. I'll be reading One Direction Imagines for the next five days. Mm -hmm. And you'll be back to report us on your... I um, will save Tuesday. the best ones I find, and mm -hmm. I will read them aloud for the class. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm never gonna stop thinking about this. Alright, good night everyone. <laughs> Take care.